think it can. It's coming into right next to me. Maybe it can't. And it's glitched on a wall. It's stuck. This is a sign I need to run. I'm just running back because I have no idea where I need to go. He lost me. He did hit me though. The sound directional is not very good. I think he's still downstairs. back over there. He looks injured though. I don't know if you can see him at all, but he looks like he's limping on his front leg. I can't turn my light on otherwise he'll see me and that'll be it. I'll be dead. I'll have to run again. I want you to wander around here, not go back up there. Now you can see him a bit. Well, this bit is hard. need to get past him. But where is he? I don't know where he is now. Hope he's in the other room. past him and so to the stocking the fog will not lift the ship is becalmed everyone lies in the half light waiting to drown in the dry air he is the paperweight for ballast something
I'm going to close this door again. It's a hidden door. I'll remember where it is, hopefully, in case I need to use it. I doubt I will. Or dead pigs. And a locked door. That's a window, I believe. Yep, can't do anything with it. I can, but it's to fill a tank again. Am I really just the other side of the... Is that truck I filled up is just over there, I think. Processing factory. Water in his shoes. Always the water and the sparks and the embers of the wheels. It's too bony. It's too damn bony. That's the same sign as these. Mandusco Meat Processing Factory, Anno 1828. Looks like they've all got their tanks, so I don't need the... Why do they have it on both sides? They've all got their tanks and they can't be removed. Therefore telling me I don't need the petrol. Or whatever's in there. That's the way I need to go, I'm pretty sure. Only pretty sure because it just feels like the right way to go. That's where I came from, so yes, it is the right way. Couldn't do anything there, could I? there. Nope. I can open all these. Let's see if I've got any more here. Yep. I won't read that one yet. I'll read it from bottom to the top. A fast getaway. Dear sweet lord of all the, that is good and holy. I must make my escape. Gah Grasp this container and its putrid contents and flee this place before that creature, that nearly man, returns. I will head for the church. Surely such an abomination could not follow unto, onto hallowed, hallowed ground. Well, it's in the basement of the church, so I think it can. Inside St Dunstan's. We sat here, I remember we sat in our black and we mourned and we prayed and we bowed our heads. How I hated God then, how I spurned him. If this is our Lord, the, this pig who robs me of my wife, then I refute his embrace. I will carve a new God for us all. Such madness, such a fool I was. If such blasphemous raving ravings had remained within me I would be doomed but even here I feel the machine drop beneath the flags and I know my path awaits me infernal machinery the engine fires the flames are stoked I hear steam in the walls vibrations upon the very air my heart falters at the prospect of throwing the lever and exposing the workings of the dark contraption.
but my children beckon me and on and I will not I cannot fail them a hellas portal it appears I have cho choice I have no choice thus I descend and may God have mercy upon my soul if this is my bedlam and I am in to be cast as Matthews then I will wear that mantle for the sake of my boys and face whatever burrow whatever horrors lie beneath the altar the Mandus processing company my soul shudders at what I have seen but at last I have reached the main part of the factory now onwards downwards to find those flood waters and drain them away like Moses I will cleave the waters and lift my little darlings clear off its vile cr cradle well at least I'm at the main factory now Like I need to go down. These men, Professor, these so-called men of vision, they would shackle the masses to a wheel and turn it till their backs break. All for that opiate, the lure of profit. These fools who lackey them, these priests, these officials, this government. They make pigs of us all. But what solution, my dear man? How to break a cycle? You cannot simply remove the promise of a better world for these unfortunates. In the workhouses, in the orphanages, the belief in heaven is surely the only sucker one can find. We do not need to wait. We can bring forth paradise now. We can speed the passion. With only a small sacrifice, we can hold the apocalypse. With just a small sacrifice, we can free our shackles and deliver them to paradise now. This game I'll be going on till 2 o'clock today. If I don't finish it by 2, then I'll be continuing it next Monday. Then I'll be on again 4 till late tonight playing Grand Theft Auto Vice City to finish it hopefully. And then I'll be back on tomorrow too. That's a nice light. Very old fashioned. I think it's time for the torch again. Or lantern. Uh oh. Last time it flickered it meant that monster was near. Okay, they go to the same spot. Whoa. Yep, that monster's near. I'm gonna hide in the dark over here. I don't know if I've got them. I think I've got I might have one of them or two of them, I'm not too sure. And I have watched a playthrough of half of the first Bioshock game and it didn't really lights not good don't 
don't really want to go further down just yet. I'll go up first. So I believe going down is the way I need to go. Well, well I didn't expect that and it made me jump a little bit. Yep, door's locked. There's notes in these drawers. Yep, there's one. Nothing in the top one. October 17th, 1899. Each compartment is ergonomically designed with a feed trough and a one trough at one end so the product naturally settles into a position ready for the stunning arms to contact to the skull. We use the natural static charge built up by the friction of the carts against the belt to build an electrical charge which is contained within glass vacuum canisters at the side of the stunning arm mechanisms and delivered along the stun arms via copper cabling. We have observed that the artificial lightning contained within these canisters seems to calm the product further. Post stunning, the line tilts sharply to the vertical, the physics of which tips the stunned product upwards to fall directly onto the hook of the bleeding line. This hook passes naturally through the haunch or, or thigh of the product and from this point we dispense with the belt and instead of instead instigate a channeled floor which creates a funnel allowing blood and byproduct excretions to collect and run to the fluid collection tanks. Wow sounds gross but efficient. It's definitely a killing floor. I'm just hoping it's still for pigs. So now to go down. That doesn't sound good makes me think I'm going to have to creep around down here. I think that means it's a safe spot. He can't get under that. I'm hoping. good there's no noises so this one is open That's what I needed to do. Oh, what? That door shut. I guess that means I can't go back. And I'm pretty sure this will be locked shut now, yeah. 
I don't know why I needed to light that, but I did it anyway. Not liking those sounds. But this room is well lit up, so it tells me that that creature's not in here. Which is good. Okay, so I need to put them in this one too. Is that all? Yep. There we go, that one's lit. water in there that I need to drown a uh, drain not drown that one's already lit I think I needed to light those so I could do these valves stop other furnaces fueled yes they are all fueled and all turned on is there anything I need to do with these one three and five all green lights Okay, six. There's four, six. sure there has to be another piece. The others have all taken two. There. There's two or three. There we go. Did something. Did I open anything else? There is more in here. Lily's arms are made of steel. Lily's arms are silent. The pistons are silent. The plant is at rest. I must poke the hornet's nest to open my way. I fear the scale of these engines suggests a far greater works than is visible from the surface. So, a uh, visible from the surface. So my friend must be correct and the larger part of this plant is underground. We are close to the thermos, thermos,
names. The, uh, I don't know. No wonder flooding is such a risk. Oh, Thames. To the River Thames. Fire and steel. The fires are stoked, assuming the same architect is responsible here as the chemical plant. I, I surmise, surmise that a centralised control system regulates and operates the pistons. It should be a simple matter of finding it and hoping the saboteur relented after simply extinguishing the fires. Well, that's definitely working now. I don't like that pig. I don't know if it's still running around or... It's just a one-off thing to... That was that shutting. Now I can't go back again. At least that tells me I'm going the right way. That's a huge piston. Largest one I have ever seen. Anything in here? This one looks like it's going to trap me in there. There it goes, yep. I have a bad feeling that that pig thing is in here. 